Hey, Matthew Swinnerton here from Event Santa Cruz, and I am here with... Jeanette Bent. I am super excited uh, to have you. I've known you for quite a bit. Um, what is your company? Stellaria Entertainment and Production. Okay, so what does Stellaria do? We specialize in aerial acrobatics, excuse me, uh, musical theater. I write nice. shows and produce them as okay. well and would love to take on other shows in the future to produce. We are also working in experiential marketing because it's right. very fun what we do and we're branching off into travel as well. So what kind of like mar marketing, like for like a company if someone yes. wants to have you be a part of their marketing experience? Mm -hmm. like, Brand yeah. Branding for other companies, okay, yeah. yeah. We tend to have a really original angle, obviously, yeah. uh, doing aerial and, and pole and acrobatics, and we have a lot of fun integrating that and building experiences for their customers and branding. That's cool. Yeah. What, what about, uh, you mentioned the musicals, like, what when I go to one of your musicals, what am I going to see? I mean, is this like a whole production that you've put on? Yes. Yeah. Yes, actually. So I love book writing, which okay. is writing scripts. Oh, wow. um, and I integrate the aerial aspect into it because it's really fun to watch that. Yeah. Um, I'm really big into literature, so I try to work in all the elements of traditional musical theater, but with the aerial acrobatics. And um, it's all original. I always come up with the, the concepts and the theme. And... Yeah. Where are these shows? Where do you have them? Um, I've been holding them at the Loudon Nelson Community Center because okay. they have really great riggable beams there and a large. <laughs> that's funny. That's theater. what you have to worry about. Like, let's, worry let's about. look. Are you looking at like the ceiling of a lot of buildings when you go in there? It's pretty much the first thing I do yeah. when I step into a building. Yeah. <laughs> <That's funny. laughs> yep. Um, I just did actually yesterday. I went down to the Radius Gallery, who is putting on a very cool interactive uh, okay. installation. I don't want to give too much away, but yeah. we will be involved in that. Wait a minute, the Radius Gallery, are the ceilings that tall? No. <laughs> yeah. <But> the, <laughs> so you're going to be very close. To, yeah, yeah. It's, it's going to be really cool. It's for the art installation. It actually works really well with what they've got. Um, and they're a very collaborative group of people. So It's super cool, that yeah. place. Yeah. yeah. Okay, so I want to know, like, the genesis of you. Like, you know, how did you... Okay, no, I, I don't want to hear that far. But, um, yeah. But, like, how did, like, you get into the aerial arts? I mean, were you, like, a... A five-year-old that was like, you know, climbing on the ceiling. What, what, how did this happen? It actually happened accidentally. It's a really oh. cool story. So I used to be the choreographer of a res two different resort companies. One, um, Manzanillo, Colimo, Mexico, Cancun, Turks and Caicos, and Florida, my stints. Okay. Um, in Cancun, there was a circus girl who was beautiful, amazing, just gorgeous. And I, I used to look at her and be like, I could never do that. That is amazing. Yeah. And uh, she said she was going on vacation, never came back. And so they looked at me and they were like, you are the one who can straighten their legs and point her toes. So we're going to start training you. And then within that week of training, I started performing in yeah. her spot. Wow. It was crazy. So that I was really thrown into it. Yeah. That's total, I mean, usually a person would be training for year, mm -hmm. right? Yeah. Yep. Plus, yeah. Um, it definitely, the flexibility part came easy to me as it had 25 plus years of dance, okay. but it was the strength part that yeah, it, was the challenge. You have to be very strong for this, right? Yeah. 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 Well, you yeah. develop the strength. Okay. Yeah. So it, when you say develop strength, I'm just curious because, yeah, is it something like I work out, like I do CrossFit before I actually get on the the silks or you know it's funny in my time of teaching Ariel it seems people fatigue quicker if they do that oh really um, okay. I've had a lot of students think that that's a really good approach but they it's a little they get a little wobbly in the yeah. air whereas normally they'll be very strong okay so hot yoga is a great practice it also um it's great obviously for stretching and stuff after training okay um but I would say just getting up there and, and doing work and then going that, about that that's like enough that's right enough. Yeah, yeah that's i mean it's it's a crazy workout yeah. when you're up there yeah i mean i can show you my guns if you need <laughs> okay show show. Should I show the guns i have it see where am i there we go there you go yeah <laughs> see i would not want to be like in a dark alley if you're mad at me or something yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so what what excites you about what you do I mean, I mean, because like you could have like okay you've done a couple shows and we originally caught and like you could like okay i did it I'm moving on. Mm -hmm. But there must be something with the aerial arts that like, I just love this. Like, yeah, what does it do? Uh. I really like the attention aspect of mm -hmm. aerial. I, it just grabs attention from anywhere. And you, I'm yeah. finding it really fun. I'm 10 years out now I'm okay. learning aerial. So I learned it um, about 23, 24. So okay. do the math. Um, <laughs> and um, what I'm finding now is you can integrate aerial into other facets. For example, musical theater. I'm also like closet secret for me is I'm also like a tech geek, a tech nerd. Okay. Love it. Really? Stuff. Okay. Tech rising. Oh yeah, okay. I plan to. I plan to try and make it. Oh, nice. Yeah, but um, I'm finding it really fun to integrate that into AI and integrate that into art installation and tech. And wow. that's what I'm working with um, Visual Endeavors on some really cool things coming up. And they're really art. Um, they're really art savvy, 
And so there's a really cool collaboration and I'm finding it really fun and interesting yeah. 10 years later to be able to integrate this aerial aspect into other facets like experiential marketing too. That's a That's really so fun thing. Yeah. I love that you're, you're not just like resting like, okay, I'm going to like, no, go on the silks. That's what they're called. Yeah. Yeah. Go on the, and then like put some music on and have people watch, yeah. but no, you're making this full experience. Yes. Yeah. Which exactly. is super cool. Thank you. So if people want to find out more about what you do and like, you know, like follow you, where do they go? Um, I'm building a new website, but I will divulge it and, and you know, say it right now. Yeah, why not? So, stellaria.company, and I can spell that. It's yes. S-T-E-L-L-A-R-I-A dot company. And that's the new website with um, all the new facets and, and different branches that we're offering and, and our new endeavors and such. Nice. Well, I love your enthusiasm for Thank what you. you do. And I know it, it like translates to whatever other passion that our viewers are, I know, are interested <laughs> in. So, um, God, and I, I've known you for a while and yeah. you just seem always like so excited and uh, full of life. So, thank um, so thank you very much. Thank you. High five. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Let's do it. Hey, I hope you enjoyed this video. And if you did and you want to see more, why don't you subscribe to our channel? We would really appreciate it. And also okay, make sure you turn on your notifications because then if you do, you'll be the first one to actually see our video. And lastly, again, if you like the video, why don't you like the video? Okay, thank you very much.